Hi Brad from WordPressSites.net uh, This 5 minute video is just going to show you how to change your header image, your logo or, or your header for your WordPress forum. Uh, this is a, a forum that I've just uh, just installed recently. It's on the top tab here of my site. So it's, it's a free forum software uh, from PHP BB and it's really good quality forum. There's quite a lot of customization work involved when you have to install it and, uh, and customize it. I want to change the size and the image of the header here. It's, it's a bit too small so I want to put my own branding on there. So uh, I'll just show you how to, uh, how to do that. The first thing you do is uh, you can use the FTP or, or file manager. Um, I prefer file manager for something small like this it's got a built-in text editor so you have to edit a little bit of code so uh, if you log into your control panel with your host uh, I'm using Bluehost uh, I'm not sure who you use but whoever you use uh, log into cPanel and, uh, and I'll show you how to do it here I am in cPanel um, if you just scroll down to uh, file manager click on file manager and uh, it will open that up now what you have to do is you have to uh, up upload your image um, to your, to the folder wherever you've uh, installed the forum software. Um, so I've installed it um, in a second level directory here uh, called, I named it WordPress Forum. So I've got a WordPress Forum and you can see all your different folders there. Just scroll down to Styles. Um, I'm using the Pro Silver theme, so click on that. And uh, in Image Set, we'll go into Image Set. And what you need to do now is just upload your uh, your banner or your logo or whatever you want included in that header I just showed you at the start. And uh, if it's located on your desktop, just click on Upload and upload it into this position here, um, which will be. Uh, Styles Pro Silver Image Set. So, so that's all you need to do as far as the image goes. And once you do, once you've done that, you just need to edit a little bit of code to make sure the sizing is correct. So you need to edit some, some just some simple CSS and custom style sheet. And uh, if you're using File Manager, you can use a built-in editor. If you're using FTP, you can use Notepad or Notepad Plus Plus. So what we have to do now, we just have to go back one and uh, we have to locate the, the file uh, style uh, CFG. We need to go into this, uh, into this um, file here and, and, and make some changes. So using file manager, just click on that and go down to uh, code edit. We'll just edit the code so we can uh, we can tell the program what size what size your uh, your header is. So we just need to locate that. I think I've just gone into the wrong. Uh, let's go to image set. Uh, where is it? Uh, here we go. Image set dot uh, config dot cfg. So just click on that. Um, code edit. Edit. And here we are here. Now just scroll down. Now we need to change the name of the logo. So I'll just copy the copy the uh, the name of the logo. So I'll just highlight the current name and just paste the new name, which is WordPress Export Expert dot uh, JPEG. And the size of the new logo uh, is uh, 60 by. just have to check. If you need to check the size of your image you just uh, just right click on it, go down to properties then click on detail and you'll find it here. It's uh, 4, 468, 468 uh, wide by 60. Alright so here we go 60 by 468. So that's all I need to do. Uh, save changes. Here we go, I've got a new header, a new logo installed in my forum, so uh, that was very, very easy. If you want a forum installed on your site, uh, contact me at wordpresssites.net. Cheers.